guys go on another video tutorial here in this video tutorial I'm gonna try to make it quick and stay under the 10 minute mark uh, my last video actually went over 10 minutes so I had to cut it in half anyways um, so let's go ahead and talk about updating Joomla um, so you have your website and you go to you go to your administration panel by going slash administrator and on the back end when you log in you see a version here if your version is not the latest version I would update immediately I have seen being one one version back and somebody getting hacked because they don't have the latest security release. So always update your your Joomla versions and keep your keep yourself up to date because you never want to get hacked, especially on a client um, website. So right now I'm at 1.5.10. This is just a test website that I have that I built for um, just for fun. So I'm going to go ahead and update this the latest version and I'm going to show you how to do it and I'm going to show you how to do it on a Mac which is kind of uh, different um, Mac handles file file merging or folder merging um, a lot differently than Windows does Windows will actually merge all the files and Mac will overwrite um, the folders and erase everything else in it anyways um, so I'll show you how what tool I use to do that so first thing you want to do is go to joomla.org And you're going to see that 1.5.20 is released. So I'm going to go to my upgrade packages. I'm going to scroll all the way down to the package I need, which is .10 to .20. And I'm going to look for the zip file because that's always what I've, I've used and it works for me. So um, you can use whatever works for you. Um, let's see, let's go to the next page. Yeah, I'm way out of date here. Um, let's see. I think I missed it. So let's go back. And here's the tar.gz. There's a zip file. So I'm just going to go ahead and download the zip file. I'm going to hit save. I'm going to delete the ones I have here already. I don't get confused. I was doing this to another site just to make sure it worked. But um, so here's my folder now, and now I have the .10 package and uh, to the .20. So I'm going to go ahead and close this window and look at the the version again, just to just to show you guys. And the tool I use is Pathfinder. Pathfinder works very well, and it's awesome because it's an all-in-one tool. This thing does a, just a ton of things. I mean, if you have the money, I think it's like 30 bucks or something. I don't, I don't know exactly what it costs, but um, I went ahead and bought it a while back, and I use it constantly. Um, so what I want to do is actually open up the package file, or not open up, but browse to the package file on one side. And on the other side, I'm going to go to my paintball website, so there's my paintball website. So I want to merge this folder with this folder. If you are doing that in Finder, you are going to you you're just going to screw up your website first of all. But um, it just doesn't work that way. Just don't do it in Finder. It's it's almost pointless. You can do it through the command line, or you can use Pathfinder like I do. So the first thing I'm going to do is take a backup of this. So I'm going to copy, and I'm actually going going to go back a folder, and I'm going to paste it right in here and now I have a copy so I'm gonna go ahead and overwrite the files in this folder with the files in this folder so what I what I'm gonna do in Pathfinder is go up to window and go to modules and folder merge and it asks me what folders do I want to merge here so I want to merge this one into this one and then I'm just gonna hit go and those are the ones I want to copy hit OK okay there we go and it's done so go ahead and close this window out and I've overwritten the files from this folder into this folder so now they're merged I'm gonna 
if we go back to our website and just hit refresh, now I'm at version 1.5.20, which that's the version I want to be at. So a couple things to test when you do that. I have seen Article Manager when you do um, when you go to edit the um, the toolbar here to be gone. So looks like this one's working fine. Um, I just go through my menus, make sure the menus are all there like I like I made them, and I just go through my users, make sure my users are there. Media Manager. So it looks like everything's fine, everything's working. Make sure my modules are there. Um, the other thing I check is the front the front page editor. If if you do a lot of that, um, for this website, I don't think uh, they're going to do any of that. So. Um, it looks fine to me, and then you want to look at the final product. Make sure nothing's wrong on your on the front of your website. And sure enough, everything's working great. And that's how you update to the latest version of Joomla. So again, I want to just thank you for watching this video. And if you have any questions, comments, or anything, just go ahead and leave them below, and I'll go ahead and reply to the message. Um, thanks again. See you later.